Here comes the street champion. The following contest is a no holds barred match. Making his way to the ring from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 250 pounds, Solo Sikoa. The younger brother of the Usos, but had a far different upbringing. When Jimmy and Jay were getting their start in WWE, Solo was still getting into fights on the street. When it comes to the street champion, Solo always puts that title on the line. Quite simply, the greatest of all time, John Cena. And his opponent from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, John Cena! No doubt about it, the absolute greatest of all time. Yeah, nobody has been on top longer, and nobody has changed the game more. You can't debate Cena's achievements, but you have to wonder, has Hollywood softened Big Match John? Match is underway, no holds barred, anything goes, but this match must be won in the ring via pinfall or submission. Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if this match ended via referee stoppage, Cole. The lengths that superstars will go in a no holds barred match, this isn't going to be pretty. He moved, but can he capitalize? Look at the power from Cena. Sit out, pendulum face buster. That's going to hurt. Got the single arm underhook, suplex! Solo getting out of harm's way. Capitalizing on Sokoa's mistake. Great punch! No disqualifications has to benefit a certain type of superstar more than others, doesn't it, Corey? Get off your high horse, Cole. A no disqualifications match benefits the superstar who's smarter, faster, and better. Using the rules to your advantage doesn't make you the villain here. It wasn't the height or distance that caused the damage, but they certainly contributed. Ooh -ho -ho. Oh, no. Oh, not to the belly! He's getting a little batter now. Oh, right to the leg. Look at this. Incredible. Ah! The Ted Lift German suplex. Clearly, an attack that very few superstars can perform with such ease. Net box suplex. Ducking out of trouble. Straight impact on the throat. Arm trapped. One after the other. And this one might be headed ringside. Uh-oh, clearing off the announce table. Oh, this is about to go from bad to worse. This is not going to be pretty. I don't want to see this happen. He knows how to avoid contact. Get his press. Close line. Good so, Lord. So effective. Locks in the gut wrench. And that definitely made solid impact. Oh, 
Nice running crossbody. Solo reverses and looks to capitalize. Oh, clothesline! Clothesline! Cena being the aggressor. Cena putting himself in the driver's seat. Straight punch! Jarring. This match is brutality starting to show on him. That's the kind of offense that got John Cena to where he is today. Sokoa prevents that from connecting. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Cena looking for it. Cena's got it in. He's got it in. The STL. I'm going to tap out here, but it ain't going to matter. You still do a lot of damage, though. How do you get out of this? I guess by doing that. Impressive. about to get crazy. What is he thinking? You sure you really want to do this? God be good, he nailed it. Call an ambulance, call a doctor, call a carpenter. We have human beings using their bodies to explode tables. Thrown back in under the ropes. And he's pulled the ring apron up looking under there for something. The universal signal for extreme. The kendo stick has entered the fray. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. Just one right after the other can't be stopped. Kendo stick impact. And you can tell there are true intentions in mind right now. This is getting more and more alarming. Cena has him up. Driving him to the canvas with the attitude adjustment. That could put Solo down for good. Here's Cena. Hey! Does Cena put this one away? A kick out! Oh my god! How? How? Kicking out at one after that is unheard of. And Cena is no stranger to big match moments, but he clearly thought that would be all she wrote. We're reaching a point where these superstars must be hurt, must be vulnerable. And who's gonna find a way to capitalize on that vulnerability? Two! Shoulder up, shoulder up! How? Saw that coming. He's one step ahead there. One response after another. Back and forth we go. Big impact from the suplex. Ooh. Ah, John Cena has him where he wants him. You can't see me. This is Vintage Cena. The five knuckle shuffle. Elbow drop. Piercing. Scary pattern starting to form as that upper area takes more damage. And the man many consider the greatest of all time playing to the crowd. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Oh, good gravy. He went for the ladder. What's he going to do with that? Coming back in the ring. He's setting it up right where he wants it. He'll head to the ring. That's just hard to watch. Scaling the ladder now. He's looking to get up that ladder, guys. A long way. So very close. Able to interrupt the attack. Cena going for it all. And off the ladder. How much 
further are these men willing to go? Well, after that, I don't think there's much further they can go. On the way to the top of the ladder. Working his way up the... What is this superstar thinking? Oh, neckbreaker! That was as creative as it was gruesome. Once you add a ladder into the mix, things only get more interesting. We just saw a clear example of that. Heads out, and he has all the time he wants. Spinning heel kick. Man, this place is jumping. He manages to escape it. Counters on counters. Technical prowess on display. Boom. Nice. Cena stays off the attack. some time. Ouch. Look at this. Suplex brings them down. Oh my goodness. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. Pulled in for a belly to belly. He was waiting for him to make his move. Takedown and more attacks to his core could hinder his offense. Sokoa keeping his opponent at bay. Samoan drop. Cover! And he kicks out of the pen in one. I am shaking my head in disbelief over how he managed to get the shoulder up. Brilliant countering by both competitors. Don't throw a punch, don't throw a punch. Oh, that never works. And what a maneuver we just saw there. You can sense it. This crowd is on pins and needles. The WWE Universe is ready to erupt. Are we close to the beginning of the end? I don't think Sokoa is aware of the danger that's coming. Uh-oh. Caught with that sharp elbow. Winding up. Samoa spike. Cena's in trouble. Cena's in trouble. Sokoa spinning solo. That's one for Sokoa before. Winding up. Oh, jeez. Sikoa Cover. might have just finished things. He manages to kick out. What strength. Cena kicks out. I mean, he doesn't say never give up for nothing, guys. This is what John Cena is made of. Never give up isn't a catchphrase. It's Cena's way of life. I thought it was over. The WWE Universe thought it was over. But you got to do a little more to finally finish this. A steel chair? Something we all know can be a devastating weapon. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. Bang! Boom, what impact! Dodges out of the way. And he's taking this to the outside now.
Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Re-entering the ring now. Hits to the core like that will render you useless. And he keeps his focus on an attack to that area. Cena is unable to stop this string of offense. Cena has to find a way to reassert himself. Punch lands. Gets inside the ring. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. And we know when he has a chair in hand, things get messy in a hurry. He's back into the ring. Outside the ring now. He has no need to rush. He's going for it all. From way up, diving double axe handle. Good night. Oh my God. Boom! We are witnessing a malicious string of attacks right now. I don't care who you are, you can't take consecutive attacks like that without it affecting you. Oh my God, this is just getting uncomfortable at this point. Oh! And you never want to count a competitor out, but there seems to be no signs of defense right now. He's able to fend off the attack. Pitch it up, Gucci! Oh. Absolutely planted. down on the knee. Just muscling up their opponent into the gut wrench. Targets the gut to end the offense. What a punch. Elbow drop. Piercing. And at this point, he's risking permanent injury. He has to be told that discretion is the better part of valor. He's had his bell rung too many times tonight to risk any more danger. Taking flight. Oh, no! That is what happens when you throw your body around. You eventually meet the pavement. And this match will head back to the ring. Haymaker connects. Oof, back elbow puts a stop to things. John Cena with a rough blow there. Cena's bringing out his full arsenal. Cena giving no quarter. Look at Cena now. We know what he has in mind. Cena has him on. Cena with an attitude adjustment. Unloading their best shot once more. There's Cena. Attitude adjustment. Is that going to decide it for Cena? Two count. What in the world? The muscle memory's got to be taken over now. Pure instinct to kick out before three. But Cena now can't take his foot off the gas. He was almost at the finish line. Winding up. Boom! Samoan spike. That could end Cena. Winding up. Targeting the throat there. And these attacks up in the neck area have gone way too far. Listen, someone needs to ring the bell before this situation worsens. From the middle rope. Oh, what a splash! Ah, look at this. Oh, the weakening arm breaker. And Cena's able to evade. Evading offense. Drop kick. Oh, oh, great height. He saw it coming. 
Look at the power from Cena. Face first. Solo getting out of harm's way. Scouted it and fired back with a punch straight to the face. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Great display of power in the Tetlift German suplex. And a clothesline. Sokoa showing no fear up there. From the top. All the way to the outside. Taken out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. I think the ringside fans expected to be this close. Oh, heavy duty right hand. Now that'll do some serious damage. Pulled in for a belly to belly. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. John Cena looking to close this thing out. And he's locked in. He's given up, but you can tell his opposition doesn't care one bit. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Looking for a unique move here. Well, on their shoulders. Oh, into an AA. And after all the damage the body has taken, I would be shocked if this match continues. A decision to continue could be career-threatening. And a well-executed move we just saw there. Cena is showing zero restraint. Cena's having his way. And Cena finds himself on the receiving end. in a dicey situation. And it is clear the mission now is to destroy and incapacitate. No count from the official, but he makes it back to ringside. Heading back to the ring. Down with the Samoan drop. Winding up. Samoa and Spike. That's got to do it. That's got to be it. Winding up. Oh, right across the throat. The cover. Sokoa might have just finished things. Oh, shoulder up before three. Far too much hustle in John Cena to let it end like that. Never give up indeed. All of that work, all these big moves, and it still didn't earn the fall. Boom, Michinoku driver. It's that time again. Time for the five knuckle shuffle. The five knuckle shuffle. Oh, Sakoa holding him at bay. He's reeling, slowly getting up. 
sure he's pumping himself up, but he's also giving his opponent a chance to recover. Going way up high. Up high. Cross body from the top. Just one step ahead. Ooh and he barely evades. These two battling to a dead heat with these reversals. Short punch. Oh my gosh! Oh, working on the arm. That. What a headbutt. Vicious. Cena now taking the brunt of the attack. Cena needs to find some energy fast. Some other drop. Incredible. Winding up. Some other spike. So much brutality with that move tonight. Sokoa, the spinning solo by Sokoa. Solo can end this now. Yes, able to survive and pull through. Here is your winner, Solo Sokoa. Celebrating now, but you know they are in need of medical attention once they get backstage. Let's hope the winner is okay. Talk about resilience. Talk about endurance. Really, talk about stubbornness. It certainly paid off here tonight, but who knows if that'll be the case next time around.